Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today is July 5th, um, 2012. It is about 9.01 a.m. Um, so pretty much what's going on in my life is I dropped my old doctor and I moved to a clinic. And I kind of, they were supposed to email me my, um, my lab results, like, so it's a system where you log into, blah, 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 but I never got the link, and I had to wait another two weeks for my lab results, which really suck, because I didn't, I like to know them right now, and I'm going to have to call in and get them, um, going to have to walk in. Um, awesome day yesterday, July 4th, uh, what happened is... I got a chance to actually talk to my brother and my mom, and we talked about a lot of things, and I actually found out my dad died a year ago, which I don't know how to feel about that, because I've never knew him, so, but, I um, found out a lot of things, how how bad of a person my dad was, and I guess my family was trying to shield me from it, but... I would rather I would have rather known that before, so that way I would never have have ever had to think about him. You know what I mean? And but I guess I didn't want that on my chest all my life. So I don't. It's a difficult subject right there because I don't know. I don't know my dad's side of my family. I only know my mom's, and it's not that many because I mean, most of my family's self-centered. That's why I don't talk to them. Um. What else? Uh, put some shocks on my mom's van. That was awesome. Uh, so much better. <laughs> so hopefully, hopefully she's safer driving out there. Um, gotta work on struts next, and I'll be happy. Uh, oh, my truck yesterday. Um, I was visiting my aunt, and magically got a flat tire, which really sucks. But. Um, Drove the quick chip, aired it up like to five, ten pounds, and drove all the way to Phoenix and dropped it off at work. Uh, right now, it's sitting there until I get a ride to work and <laughs> um, get a new tire. Um, I'm pretty sure it's screwed up really bad, but uh, pretty much is it. I've been waiting for my lab results. Oh, uh, major news: uh, the biggest impact on my life was Complera. I finally started antiretroviral, and due to the fact that, that my finances aren't where they should be, so the cheapest alternative is medicine through Axis, and I just, yeah, uh, so I pay four bucks a month for my complayer, and that's it. That's why I'm in a hurry to get my lab results, because I want to see if it's working or not. Cause if it's not, I want to get off of it. Get off of it. Um, first two weeks of Complera were fucking hell. Um, dizzy, nauseous, 24/7, like nauseous. Um, without eating, with eating, didn't want to throw up, but I was nauseous. Um, headaches, freaking um, body aches, like my whole body. Uh, my stupid doctor decided to tell me that there was. No, um, no side effects, which I've been told by a number of people that, which is pretty bold. That's what they say, because every medicine has, every medication has a side effect. So, but other than that, everything's going all right. Um, I like where I live. I'm adjusting to it still. Um, you see, I got my paintings on my wall finally. Uh, my room's a mess, but I'm working on that. Uh, I know I don't want to have it a mess for tomorrow for my birthday, but you know what? I was supposed to go to San Diego, but my job screwed it up again. Um, usually they screw me over on my birthdays because I usually request them off. But I, luckily, um, they gave me the option to work Friday or Saturday, so I chose Friday instead of Saturday because I didn't want to work on the weekend and I was supposed to go to San Diego but because I don't know they didn't want me off I ended up having to work on Friday so Saturday I'm leaving to Tucson to go hang out go hike, go do whatever 
if I can get my tire fixed on my truck. But other than that, everything's going well. Can't wait. 24 years of life, right? I'm lucky to wake up each day and start another day. Just go from there. But um, other than that, um, I don't know what to say. I'm looking back into. Um, Supplements, but I need to get my uh, finances back on track. Living here is actually saving me a little bit of money, but I've had a lot of stuff in the last two weeks that have caused me to spend um, like over back at what I was spending before on gas, which is $100 a week. I think one week I only spent like 25 bucks to refill my gas tank. If I can keep that up, I'll be happy because I'll be able to just put like $200 towards food. Um, so. I'll be happy once I get everything back on track, finances, 24 years, tomorrow, at, I think it's 9 a.m., so, uh, work at 1, hopefully, um, what I'll do is I'll go to breakfast with my friend in Tempe, and then for lunch, I'll go eat somewhere, maybe Joe's Real Barbecue, um, they usually give free entrees, I mean, free birthday gifts, so, free birthday meals, up to $10, awesome. Really good barbecue. Where else can you hear music like this? I wish, wish I had more people in my life. My friend is in Wisconsin. His dad's sick, so I feel bad for that. Because his sister was in Hawaii and she had to leave early, so um, I'm just, yeah, I feel bad because other people are worse off. But, uh, but. Other than that, everything's going well, work-wise, I'm still frustrated, but I'll deal with that one day at a time. Um, I'm going to try to move move upwards, the ladder effect, because if you're not satisfied with the way one person's handling it, you better go up, right? So I'm going up. I, I was waiting for a call from HR to figure out what's going on with them and all that, so I'll talk to you guys later. You guys take care. Be safe. Hopefully everybody enjoyed the holiday and just be safe.